Hello YouTube, this is Pikachu and Charizard, and welcome to, what is this, episode 10 now? Yeah, episode 10 of Pokemon Black and White Nuzlocke. Yes, this is a Nuzlocke run. Hold on a sec. Alright, sorry about that. Um, okay. Now guys, in the last episode, what did I do? Um, I took on the gym, yeah, I took on the gym, I think. I don't know, it's been a while since I've recorded. Um, so we took on the gym. Um, and we caught ourselves a new Pokemon. We went to the inside of Pinwheel Forest and caught ourselves a sea waddle. As you can see right here, named it Leafy. It was a level 14, it's got a decent nature. Now, as you can tell, guys, I did a little bit of off-screen training. I leveled up Seawaddle, Leafy, up a level. I got Woody up a level, and Dream up a level. Everybody else is the same. And guys, this is what I want to do. I'm having a lot of fun playing this. I want to see what's going to happen how, if I have a really long episode. So guys, this episode is going to be an hour long. I know you guys have seen half an hour episodes, but I really want to do an hour long episode. I don't know what it is about this, but I just want to do this because I want to see what happens after a while because I'll get more into the game. Um, my goal is within an hour to basically reach the uh, third gym. You know, maybe take it on. I don't know. But, you know, just have something happen. Um, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to be going through this. Now, I need to do some healing because I did a little bit of off-screen I didn't do a whole lot because I wanted to do a little bit to get a little more ready for the, uh, upcoming, uh, battle. I mean, yeah, upcoming Pinwheel Forest. Because there are a lot of trainers in here, guys. We do have, I believe we have two heals. Uh, yeah, we have that nurse right outside of Pinville Forest, and we have the one in the city, that green city, I believe. All right, okay, whatever. Um, if we don't have the one in that green city, sorry, but I'll have to check and make sure before I use it. So. Let's just get right into this. Let's go take on this plasma grunt. My, my. Did you be looking for something? Yes, I want my dragon skull back. We've got to start it in the next episode. Ah, a purloin. What level are you? 16. I believe you are a dark type. Leafy, you're a part bug. I think you can take this on. Let's try one bug bite. Because I know Carloin is a dark type. So guys, this could hurt. This could hurt this person. And indeed it does. Did you die? What? You barely live. Whatever. Alright, just as long as he doesn't miss. Leafy, this would be awesome if you could win your first battle ever without any... Oh, gosh. Let's try one more. You're not quite ready to be doing this. Oh, don't die. Don't die. You don't have... Whew. Okay, I thought I'd do a little more. I was a little scared there. Okay. So down goes the first plasma grunt. Ah, crap. I forgot to read what it says. Sometimes I forget to read what they say. Uh, sorry, I'm empty-handed. Do I like? Do I look like the kind of girl to carry a heavy load? Better try some, someone else. Um, any items? Nope. Oh, forgot one thing. We need to uh, set that uh, dowsing machine we got there. Oh, we got an item over here. Hidden item? It's down there. 
yeah, over there. Especially, guys, dowsing machines are very helpful through Nuzlocke runs. Espe especially, well, in any game, especially Nuzlocke runs. They are especially helpful in Nuzlocke runs. Put on one of our repels. And then, whoops, no. We want to set our dowsing machine. Oh yeah, that's right, guys. Um, ah, crap. Alright, whatever. Venipede, guys, this was the other Pokemon I actually wanted in this area. It was either Seawaddle or Venipede. Venipede would have been pretty nice. I wouldn't have probably used it right now. But, guys, oh, I forgot to mention this. Um, Leafy. Um, the thing about Leafy, guys, is, um, to be honest, I would never suspect to use him. I didn't look up his stats or anything. Um, but I need something in case I ever run into a water type. I mean, to be honest, that's not going to happen here. But, I mean, what if it does? I mean, honestly, guys, I can't uh, ever assume anything. So, yeah, we're going to have a leafy just... We're going to have that seawaddle here just in case we ever need something. Um, but... What I really want to say, guys, is that the main three I'm using are, uh, Dream. A tiny mushroom, whatever. Nothing worth picking up. Whatever, though. Alright, continue on, fight this little boy. But, um, you know, so the main three I'm going to be using are Dream, Crash, and Alley, and then actually, and uh, Block as well. Those are the big four. Uh, Woody's not gonna be used as much, and neither is Leafy. They're kind of gonna be a little more neglected than the other four. But, um, you know, they're just kind of there. Um, you know, I mean, I don't want to over. I mean, I don't want to like do way too little of training. I kind of want to keep up, like. I mean, to be honest, where, uh, like, let's, let's take a look at Dream right now. Dream's a level 20. Woody's a level 18. You know, somewhere around there. I mean, you know, mo I'm going to try and keep all my Pokemon pretty leveled out. Like, 20 to 22 right now is where all my main Pokemon are right now. And then, you know, Woody and Leafy are kind of down there a little bit. Alright, Timber, another Pokemon that, uh, Dream can take out. Now, another thing I gotta address, guys, um, I haven't had much problem with this yet, is PP. Um, the amount of, the number of times the Pokemon can use a certain move. Um, that's one of the biggest things for healing, guys, because I think I'm pretty good at healing them on HP with potions and super potions. But, I mean... Um, honestly, guys, the heals are basically to raise up the PP, because you don't get a whole lot of ethers. Whoops. You guys, honestly, we don't get a whole lot of ethers through this game. And, uh, what the, where the heck is that item? Alright, it's up there more. Um, I just want to check my team right now. Um... Um, we need to heal Dream up. Okay. Wow, guys, we're already nine minutes into this, and we've only fought a few trainers. This is going by fast. Um, but, yeah, yeah, guys, I was serious. This is going to be an hour-long video. You guys can probably already tell, but for me, I have no idea how long this video is going to be. Um, yeah, Leafy, you're good for now. You're not going to be fighting anyway. So there is a Pokemon Ranger right here. They hide in this little grassy area. Get great powers drawn from nature without opposing it. Okay, whoops. <sighs> Sorry, getting a drink. That is the strength of Rangers. Okay. So that's what you got to say. Alright guys, I'm addressing this a little early guys, but I mean, there is one thing I'm a little worried about, 
um, a little later on, guys, in the next area where we can catch another Pokemon. Um, I am a bit worried about the next place. Oh, crap, I shouldn't have switched that. That was not a good switch. Because, Allie, you, in the daycare, you had to forget. You just had to forget your flying type text. You just had to forget. Alright, whatever. The only flying type attack you know is Roost. Actually, that is a good thing you know Roost now. But I mean, seriously, why would the daycare person make you forget Air Cutter? You need that. Alright, Allie, you've got to learn another attack. You've got to learn a flying attack. Because, I mean, right now, guys, I have one Pokemon that can really do a lot of damage here. Allie, you... You evolve at level 21. Seriously, you're going to evolve once you level up. I know you are. So guys, there are there could be a couple evolutions in this episode actually. Um I know there will be a Pokemon in this episode con considering this is going to be an hour episode. Um Yeah, we're going to keep the way it is. Um, you're not going to see Timber a whole lot, actually, guys. I mean, seriously, there's not much I can do with him right now. Like, right now. Right this instant. Because... Um... I mean, honestly, guys, we're just fighting a bunch of bug types. Right, what the heck? Alright, fight another one of these guys. Come on, let's take a deep breath. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Alright, next letter. Pokemon, fight. Okay. <sighs> Sorry guys, kinda thirsty. Ooh, leafy. Let's see if you can fight this, because honestly, I don't really have much else to fight you. And that did not do a whole lot. Let's see how much this does. This should do quite a bit. Alright, as long as you can survive one more hit, Leafy. Oh, God! Whew, okay. That scared me. Guys, I would have gone down to 1 HP if that thing hit 5, or, unless there was a critical hit. And Leafy, you're going up levels. Nice. When do you evolve? I've never thought to even use you, Seawall. Leafy? I've never thought to use you. Alright, where are you? Let me tell the first war off. Tiny Mushroom, once again. Alright, another Team Plasma member. Let's just make sure I got everything ready. Alright, Leafy, you're getting kind of low. Let's switch to Woody. Really quick. You know, mix it up a little bit. Leafy, you're getting up there. But, uh, let's do a little bit of training with Woody. Alright, you can take on a pat right, Woody. Just do a takedown. Take down this patron. Oh, forgot to read what it said. Crap. Yep, I'm here to buy time. And if you don't stop lively, we're going to get away. Gee, thanks for that info. Um. Alright, who am I going to start with here? Let's go to block. Get him in there a little bit. You know, do something with him. He hasn't done anything at all. We're almost 15 minutes into this episode. Let's just go ahead and let him go. And actually, guys, um, oh, we still have a little bit to go. Whoops. All right. Go back to Woody. Whoops. I thought the final battle was right up here. Never mind. We still got a little bit of ways to go. Use another repel. And move forward. 
Paralyze heal. Got enough of those, but whatever. We got another one. And yet another. Um, Ranger. Ranger Miguel. And you have a Pansier. Pansier. You know what? I just realized this. I need a water type. Just remember that. I need a water type. Um. You know what, Woody? Let's keep you out. Let's see what you can do. Get your same level as this thing. You can take some hits. Alright, just take down. Ooh. And it uses John. I do not want Woody fall asleep. We're switching out now. Um. I'm just switching the block. <laughs> First time we're using him in the episode. Oh. Incinerate. Ooh. That is not good. Really? You're gonna be a yawn spammer? A yawn spammer. Really now. Crap. Okay. Um switch back into the dog. Just gonna go back to back between these two. Go into Woody. Now guys, I'm having a lot of fun playing this Nuzlocke. I am not even kidding. Um, this has definitely been really fun. Um I mean to be honest guys, I'm not even part I'm not even through the whole game yet. I mean seriously, I'm only like not even a quarter through the game yet. Let me take out my gill. Did you feel my wildness? Uh, yeah, I did actually, I guess. <laughs> um, and it gives us a Petra Berry. These rangers, this is the only way you get berries in this game, is through them giving you items. What the? It's an Audino! <laughs> Can't catch you, but let's kill you. This is a perfect chance for experience. Block, get in there. This is your perfect chance for experience. I didn't even know I ran into that. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Guys, I definitely recommend um, you, in any area that you're in, and you've already caught the Pokemon, I definitely recommend you look for Shaking Grass, because Audinos... Um, you find Audinos, um, most often in, uh, shaky grass, and, um, they give a lot of experience, like, watch, Block will probably level up from this, chances of it, because these things give a lot of experience, and I mean a lot. They are perfect for wild Pokemon battle training, they're perfect for Nuzlocke runs. Because they're the perfect thing to go off and train against. Because you don't have to waste as much PP. And see, look at that. They both got about 600. There is an item over here. Let's get this. I believe it's a TM. Please be a good one. Grass Knot. This is perfect for Leafy. Let's see if you can learn it. Oh, it's a leafy, 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 leafy. Whoops, that's not even the chance. Can you learn it, Leafy? Indeed you- Block! And crash! Alright, Leafy, let's just teach it to you. You're the bugging grass type. Um, get rid of your string shot. I'm not gonna use it. I want good accuracy on moves, too. Leafy. You are going to be helpful. That's the only item we can get. Let's get out of here. Perfect timing. Talk about perfect timing. Alright, this is where I wanted... Uh, Let's switch... No, that's not what I wanted to switch. I wanted to switch Leafy in first. 
Then, I want to use a potion or two. Alright, we got two potions left. Let's just... Eh, let's keep it there. Let's save our last potion for now. And go and fight this guy. A pursuer. A, <laughs> a kid like you. Beat some of us. That can't be helped. But I'll take you on now. Alright, so this is apparently the guy that has the skull. He must be the last front. Oh, I'm gonna need three Pokemon. Let's see what he's got. A Pat Rat. Ooh, I thought you had a Sand Dial. I thought you started off. My bad. <laughs> My bad, you don't start off with a Sand Dial. Alright. Now, uh, what am I going here? You know what, Dream? Let's go to you. Give you a little bit of leveling up. I think he does have a sand dial, but that's kind of why I uh, healed up Leafy, because I might need him for the sand dial. Screw uh, uh, you. Oh, crap. Not bad. I hate that move. I hate that move. I hate that move. I hate that move. Okay, good. Very nice. Patch rat. And then I think his last one is a sand dial. So just side beam this thing. Kill it. Goodbye, Patch rat. Oh, critical hits. The most common way a Pokemon, a trainer's Nuzlocke Pokemon die. Critical hits. <sighs> Guys, that's a bit. Alright, get out of here. This thing's part dark. I do not want you in there. Switching to Luffy. Let's give you a shot here. Not gonna do much. Sandtoon, eh? <laughs> you did 1 HP. What does that do? Cause I kill you. I kill you. Plasma! If this keeps up, what, whatever you said, I didn't be able. I wasn't able to read it. You guys can go back and read that if you want. Fine. Take your stupid skull. Do, 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 do. We get it. Yay! Dragon skull. We got a dragon skull. Who's this guy? How are you holding up, fellow subject of our king? Gorm of the Seven Sages. I'm mortified that. This skull, which we went to so much trouble to obtain, was stolen from us so easily. It's not important. We can afford to abandon the dragon skull. According to the results of our research, this is not the legendary Pokemon for which Team Plasma is looking for. It is completely unrelated. But we will not allow anyone to disrupt our plans and get away with it. We will fix it so you never interfere with us again. Berg, there you are. Oh, sweet. The bug Pokemon were getting all worked up, so here I came. And what do I spy with my little eye? The important looking guy. <laughs> the important looking guy. Are you here to help your friends whom I defeated? Lenora, there you are. Tyler, Berg. The, other, the others didn't have anything. And who are you supposed to be? Is this the big boss? I am one of the seven sages of Team Plasma. Gets us. Another one of the seven sages will liberate Pokemon with all words only. There you go, now you can read it. The reminder of the seven sages have ordered their com compatriots to take Pokemon with full force, but the odds are a little against us now. To you, the bug Pokemon user, Bird, and the other and the normal Pokemon user, Lenora, I say, know your enemies, know yourself, and you need not fear the result of a hundred battles. This time we shall retreat quietly. To secure the liberation of Pokemon, we will steal Pokemon from trainers. Even though you are gym leaders, we will not tolerate any further obstruction from you. In any case, we will settle this someday. I hope you are looking forward to that time as much as I. And they mysteriously vis disappear. They're a speedy bunch. What are, you, what are you planning to do, Bird? Are you going to chase them? Hmm. We got back the stolen skull, and if we corner them, 
There's no telling what they might do. I think I'll be heading back, Lenora. Well, now, well, I'll be waiting for your challenge at Castellia City Pokemon Gym. Yes, indeed, I'm certainly looking forward to it. So he's the next gym leader, guys. He's a bug type user. You can tell who's gonna be used then. Excuse me, Tyler. You're holding the Dragon Skull. You worked so hard to get back, right? Thank you so much. With a kind trainer like you taking care of them, the Pokemon with you must be happy. Here's a token of my gratitude. Please use it carefully. A Moonstone, guys. This is exactly what I needed. This Moonstone can evolve certain Pokemon. By the way, guys, one of my Pokemon on my team needs a Moonstone to evolve. Um, let's take a look at them. Who could it be? Leafy, Crash, Dream, Block, Woody, or Allie? Alright guys, I've already told you Allie evolves in- uh, whoops, just about fell. Allie already evolves at the next level. Crash is starter, they never evolved that way. Um, so it could be any of the other Pokemon, but guys, if you've played Pokemon Black and White, you know what I'm talking about. This Moonstone is going to be used right now. I'll just tell you who it's used for as soon as you see it pop up. Who is it? Here we go. You're about to find out who can evolve right now. It's Muna. Dream is evolving. Yes, guys. I am very excited. This thing was a special attacker and could take a lot of hits before. But now this thing can take twice as much and do twice as much damage. Musharna, guys. This thing can take an F load of hits. Let's look at its stats. Guys, I want to show you guys. This thing is amazing. I've used it before. Dream, guys, has just become a freaking amazing. Look at that. It's a Mushana. It's a Mushana. Look at those stats. That's special attack. 58. Defense, 43. Special defense, 42. Holy crap, guys. This thing can take some pretty good hits. Aside from that, look at that special attack. This thing, guys, this thing has probably just become my best member right now. Well, maybe other than Crash. But, seriously, this thing, guys, is amazing. Not even gonna lie. Alright, guys, now you may, you may think... Oh, by the way, guys, take a look at this HP. I forgot to show you guys the HP. Compare it... Compare it to Crash's. Alright, look at Crash's. It's 76 HP. This thing is a level shorter than it. Uh, two levels, actually. And it has five more HP. 81. This thing is two levels shorter of Crash. And this thing is going to have more HP even when Crash evolves. I've used both these guys at once before, when I went through, originally when I went through white. I started over and then did this Nuzlocke run. Um, and another item's right here, a Miracle Seed. This thing, guys, is perfect for Seawaddle. My Leafy. Dang, they're just throwing some good items at my Pokemon. So, guys, I'm in a pretty safe position. Guys, I'm feeling pretty safe right now. With the mix of Leaf, now with the Miracle Seed, I think, guys, I, I'm i in a good mood now. And we're only about halfway through this episode. Alright, so there's a few more trainers we can fight through here. Like this hiker, I believe. Nope, you can't fight him. I'm not going to read what they say right now. I don't really want to. Um, so these are the last couple traders we can fight on this area. Let's just fight them now and then use our free heal back there. There's a trainer back there we can fight to get our free heal from a nurse. I'd rather use that because we need that. I need that. Let's go ahead and switch into Dream right now and show you guys the true power of this thing. This thing, guys, is probably my... Maybe 
even my best Pokemon. As of right now. As of right now. This thing, guys, that nature is just so impressive. I mean, I am so lucky I got this thing. Look at that. Two hits, and she's done like 10 HP. I mean, honestly, guys, there's only two types that can take out this thing. Dark type. Speaking of dark types, per loin. Alright, switching to Leafy. Um, so, honestly, guys, dark types and bug types are really all I have to worry about, and I hardly even have to worry about them for, uh, Musharna, my dream. Because, guys, this thing is pretty freaking amazing. Oh, God. Leafy, I don't want to lose you now. I've got a lot of super potions. Let's just go ahead and... Alright, no air cutter. No air cutter. No air cutter. No air cutter. Leer. Whew. Can I bug bite you? Can I bite you with my bug bite? Can I bite you like a bug? Can I bite you like a bug? I want to bite you like a bug. Bite you like a bug. Bite you like a bug, bug. Light you, bite you like a bug. Bite you like a bug, bug. Light you, bite you like a bug. Bite you like a bug, bug. Cause I am a bug, bug. Ah, ah, I am a bug. I think this thing evolves at level 18 to its second form. I don't know, guys. This is one of the longest lasting Pokemon that takes forever to evolve. Um, yeah, keep Leafy in the front. You know, Leafy, you may actually be good. Alright, you're not a trainer. You are. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight you in the morning. Alright, I guess I'm gonna fight him off screen. Sometime in the morning. This is late at night. Well, not really late at night. It's like 10 o'clock. Um, so let's go ahead and fight this trainer. Yeah. Who are you? Last. And the... Alright. Okay. Oh god, you have to do that. Uh, I need to switch you out. Ooh. That's another thing, guys. I need an electric type. Or a dark type. These flying types are just going to be annoying for me. Luckily, Woobat is not much of a problem, so I'm going to switch into Woody here. Heart Stump. See, guys, I have two great defensive Pokemon right here. Dream and Woody. You two are just the perfect match. Because this thing can take some hits. Sadly, you're not the most powerful attacker. But whatever. Um, you just keep fighting. Just kick this Woobat. Bootay. Bootay. Alright, what else do you got? What else do you got? You got another Woobat? I'll kick its butt. Bite it. Bite it like the Woody I know and love. Even though you're a female and it doesn't make much sense. Whatever. I don't care. Impressive a battle, whatever. Yeah, I am impressive. I know I am. Alright, I believe this is the last trainer on this route. And then we're gonna go use our free heal. Stay together. That's the theme of my research. The theme of your research. All right. Ooh, a Muna. You got yourself a Muna. I believe you can take that out, Leafy. Your bug bites can kill this thing. I believe. Indeed, I am right. That doesn't. To me, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Psychics can take out. Um. Uh, psychics can. Uh, take out, uh, I mean, bugs can take out psychics. That's a little weird to me. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Intimidate, even though it's a special attacker. And Woody's gonna level up here. Very nice. Now, I'm actually neglecting my dream. I've only used it once since I evolved it. I need to start using it. Work up. Um... 
I forgot I made you for get work up for takedown. Nah, we'll keep our moves. Nope, I meant to keep my old moves. Keep give up on work up. Plus I have the TM, so if I ever actually want to teach you work up, I can just teach it to you. That's another thing I love about this game, guys. TMs are in they last forever. They never run out. They're like HMs, except you can make them forget them. Alright, um, let's take a look at our Pokemon. Uh, guys, I want to use my heal. Uh, because Leafy's getting kind of low. As you can see, he's getting... Um, uh, actually, you know what? We could go on. Nah, I don't want to risk it. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I just I just don't want to risk it. Plus, I want to take the experience now from this person. Oh, did I already fight you? I cheated! I wasted a free heal. I didn't think I fought you. What? Okay. Uh, um, this is kind of weird. I think I had a free heal back there. Um, so I guess I don't have any more free heals. I don't know, guys. I'll have to check back some of my old videos. Um, make sure I didn't cheat. But, guys, we can move on now. <laughs> About halfway through this episode, and we spent the whole time in here. Told you guys this place takes a while. That's cut. That's partially why I wanted to do the hour-long episode. That's Well, that's actually a good reason why, but... Um, alright guys, it's time for you guys to watch some cool epicness here. Hold on. Just take a look at my team for a second. Yeah, crash. Whoops. Crash. Alley. Block. Dream. Leafy. And Woody. Guys, these six Pokemon right here are all very nice. Very nice Pokemon to have. They're very impressive. Most of their natures are great, except for um. Oh, they all have great natures, except except Allie. Other than Allie, they all have pretty great natures. All right, guys. Now watch as if I run straight through this. I'm not gonna talk to the trainers. They doesn't really matter. They don't give you anything. Um, just run through here, guys. This is really cool. Especially if you listen to the end as you're leaving. This bridge is freaking amazing. This is, like, the best part of this game. One of my favorite, um, images. Just looking. Just look at this. Just look at this. This thing is amazing. Alright, I'm gonna shut up real quick as we finish this. See guys, if you run straight through, that ending just works out perfectly. That's just awesome. Um, and we're about to head into the next city of the game, Castelia City. Welcome! There's a Pokemon Center right there. We get a free heal right off the bat. Um, now actually guys, I want to grab something real quick. Um, I forgot to tell you guys, I put, I think I forgot to tell you guys. Um, I put Vine in the daycare. Um, just in case, guys. Um, this guy is gonna ask you, um, which of the three monkeys do you have? Panpour, Pansy, or Pansage? I'm gonna say Pansage, because I have Pansage. And he's gonna give you the stone based off of it. Um, so I get a Leaf Stone. Um, this will evolve your monkey into either one of its three forms. Simi-Sage, simi seer or simi Poor. They're all pretty good. They're all decent. But, um, to be honest, guys, I don't want to use Pansage because I have, a uh, Seawaddle here. Um, but if we do lose Seawaddle, that could be a possibility. Just saying. Um, now there is one last thing we can do. 
Um, there is something I want to do. We can run through here, and there are a bunch of people. See, look at all these people. They're amazing. Woo! Oh, actually, it's night, so there's not a whole lot of people. But, um, I want to catch a Pokemon. Guys, this, there's an area right up here, right past Castelia. Oh, by the way, I'm going to go buy some lemonades eventually. Once I run out of Super Potions, I'm going to buy some lemonades from there. They basically cost as much as a, um, two of them cost as much as a hyper, no. One of them costs as much as a super potion, I believe, or a potion, I forget which. And, um, <clears throat> how do I say this? Um, um, it costs as much as a potion or a super potion, and it heals as more than a super potion. It heals 80, so it's very nice. Right here, this desert area, there are three Pokemon in this area you can catch. Um, the first of the three is Sandile. Now, Sandile is a dark and ground type. Sandile is pretty dang good. It's got a load of attack. I just, actually, out of the three, I really don't care who I get. Actually, they're all very good to have, in my opinion. Um, next up is Scraggy. Scraggy, a fighting and dark type. Scraggy is another load of attack Pokemon. It also has a lot of defense. Um, again, another great Pokemon. Uh, it's just the thing with Scraggy is I already have two fighting types. So to be honest, I don't want Scraggy because I already have two. Scraggy is definitely really good though. And then Darumaka. Darumaka is an all-out fire type. It's another Pokemon with a load of attack. It's just attack. It has no defense, guys. Um, Darumaka is very good as well. I really want Darumaka as well. But I have a Tepic. I already have a fire type. So, basically, if I get Scraggy, it's going to be back up if Timber or Pignite dies. If I get Darumaka, Darumaka will be back up for if Tepic dies. I mean, Pignite dies. And then Sandile's the only one I would actually consider using because I don't have a ground type. Sandile, I would actually probably end up using. I don't know who I'll take out. Though. That's the that's the rough part if I end up with Sandile. So anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and get in here. Let's see who we get. I want any of them. Mostly Sandile. Get this item in X accuracy. Doesn't really care care much for it. All right, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Sandile. This is just what I was hoping for. Um. Alright. Intimidate, yes. This is one of its abilities, Intimidate. I forget the other one, so. Um. Alright. I want to switch into something that can actually take this thing's hits. Very well, Dream. Um, and then I'm going to throw Pokeballs at it like mad. How many Pokeballs to crap? I forgot to buy Pokeballs. Son of a B word. Oh, I got eight. That's more than enough. Well, actually, that could it could be a little risky. I don't want to risk hurting it. Um, hopefully I can get this in a couple. And if we get on the first one. Whew! All right, now Sandile. Um, what can we nickname you? You are great. I really want to use you, actually. Desert Croc Pokemon. Actually, guys, I want to say something here. Sand interesting fact, guys. The original game I got was black and white. <clears throat> and you were in my original team. I actually used you going through the game. My original team, I'll tell you guys a lot, the Pokemon we've seen that were in my original team. Um, Oshawott, I used Oshawott in my original team. I had Blitzel in my original team, Drillbur, and the last one we've seen so far is Sandile. There were two other Pokemon I've used in my original team of black and white, and I will tell you guys what they were later when we actually run into them. Um, but for now, Let's give this thing a nickname. I don't know what to call you. Um. Well, 
Let's call you Chomp. Because you're like a chomping gator. Let's call you Chomp. Plus you're kind of, you're kind of like a gar chomp. So you're chomp. Alright, he's in the PC. Um, alright, what are we running now? Another sand aisle. <laughs> and it's a female. If I would have called you, I would have named you Big Mama. I don't know. <laughs> Something like that. Whatever. We caught a sand aisle. Amazing. Alright guys, I'm pretty freaking excited now. The big problem is, uh, I don't know who to get rid of. I was hoping a little bit more for Darumaka in case. I was hoping a little more for the other two because I knew I'd really want to use Sandile if I got him. But the problem is, I've already got six great Pokemon. Alright, let's take a look at your nature first off. If you've got a good nature, we're definitely using you. If you've got a horrible nature, like, say, lowering your attack, then we may not be using you. So let's just, let's just, uh, check and see what it is. Just, oh my gosh. Alright, you know what? Screw it. Leafy, kill this thing with a raisin leaf to the face, please. Just, just kill it, just kill it. That's all I need. Oh, yes, good, good. Kill it, kill it. Good job, Leafy. Good job. Okay, um, get the heck out of here. Oh my god! Seriously, Darumaka. See, I would have, I wouldn't have been too bad this year. Um, see, Waddle, I want you out of here. I want you out of here. Switch to Dream, and then try to run away. Actually, no, Dream, let's level you up. You're so close to leveling up. Holy crap. That did a lot of damage. Holy crap. Oh, God. Kill it, 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 kill it. Get out of this. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get the F out of here. Level up. Good job, Dream. Darma like I said guys, Darmaka are all attack. They they have they have special they have some special attack. They're actually pretty good at special attack too. But anyways Let's run down here. Down 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 to the bottom of the city. Where we will meet our chomp chomp. That that sand friend. Chomp, chomp, chomp. I'm singing Spongebob completely wrong. Um, this guy's gonna run into us. He's gonna be like, Where are my sunglasses? Blah, 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 blah. Here, take these. It's the TM Flash. We're not gonna be using Flash. Just saying. We can bright up places. We don't really need that right now. If we do need it, I'll teach it to a Pokemon, but we don't. So, let's go take a look at our... Um... Good ol' Good ol' uh, Chomp Oh, uh, we don't need to heal Don't worry about you, you're in our way But we don't need you Chomp Um What's your nature? Nah Eh Eh You're a little more defensive now, but uh you are fast and you are offensive. Uh, yeah. I mean, you're not raising or lowering anything that's you're actually good at, so that's not too bad. So pretty decent. It would have been awesome if it was raising its attack. That would have been amazing. That would have been amazing. Um, but I want to use this. I want to use. All right, guys. Sorry about that. My camera died. Um, now what I was saying was, the question was, who do I get rid of? Did I get rid of Leafy? Do I get rid of Woody? Do I get rid of uh, Dream? Block? Um, Alley? Or... Crash? Um... Oh my gosh. 
To be honest, um, I kind of am thinking this. Um, let's get rid of, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to do this, guys. Um, I am going to take out Woody. Say goodbye to Woody, guys. He's not, all right, let's, let's relive our, uh, rest in peace Pokemon. R.I.P. That's what our box is called. R.I.P. So we've got, uh, we've got our Parrot, uh, Remy. You guys remember him. He was a sacrifice in the second gym. I knew somebody was going to faint. I didn't want to risk anybody dying, so I switched into Remy. That's why I took him, because he was a sacrifice. And there we go. So he was there. Um, now here's what I want to do. Um, alright, actually, hold on, let's deposit, uh, Chomp real quick. And then withdraw, Woody. Um, now, alright, guys, I'm gonna flash, I mean, skip to, uh, not flash, skip to uh, the daycare, because I'm going to go there, um, and I'm going to do a couple things real quick, alright, so I'll see you guys in a sec when I'm there. Okay, it was a lot of walking, whew, um, but guys, oh, whoops, no, I don't want to go in the PC, what I want to do is, actually I need to deposit some more, because, sadly we can only keep, uh, one Pokemon in the daycare right now. Eventually, we'll be able to keep two. Um, but let's just put Leafy really quick into, uh, the, uh, box. Alright, guys, sorry about that. I just deposited, uh, my, uh, Leafy really quick. Because I need an extra slot because, um, we're going to take back our Vine. It is now level 18. It grew seven levels. Eight levels, actually. And there we go. We got Vine back. Um, first off, let's leave a Pokemon. Because I want to put Woody in there. Um, just in case we, you know, ever need him. You know, something. Um, and guys, I do want to do something. Let's use our Leaf Stone on Vine. Like I said, guys, this is how they evolve. And two evolutions in one episode. It was an hour. I was hoping for one more. I was hoping maybe Allie could evolve too. But we didn't really use Allie because it doesn't have a flying attack. But here we go, guys. Uh, Vine is now a Tim Sage. And there we go. I am so sorry, Woody. I am so sorry I am not keeping you. Um, is there anybody else? Because to be honest, guys, it's just there's nobody else I really want to, uh, um, get rid of. I mean, honestly, um, I mean, maybe Leaf. Maybe Leaf. Alright, you know, Lick, Vine Whip. You know, Lick, Vine Whip, Fury Swipe, and Leech Seed. Okay. Um. But that's the end of this episode, guys. I'm just gonna say that now while I'm withdrawing my two Pokemon. These are the two we're gonna be training now, guys. I feel so bad, guys. The first Pokemon I caught in this game was Woody. Um. But, you know, he'll live, he'll live a long life now. Um. If any of our Pokemon die, though... Woody is definitely our next guy. That's the great thing about the daycare, guys, because, I mean, they can keep leveling up while you go through the game. So, for example, guys, let's say, um, Leafy dies in the gym. We can run all the way back here and grab Woody, and, you know, he could be a couple levels higher. And then, bam! I mean, guys, we basically have a set team here. This, is, this guy's I'm not even kidding, is a perfect team. Um, so, I'm gonna run back, um, that's the end of this episode, 
Um, stay tuned for the next episode of Black and White Nuzlocke. It's gonna be another hour-long episode. Um, you know, this is, like, just under an hour. So I say that's pretty good. I think the next one will be a little over an hour, I guess, to even out to two hours. But the next episode will be another hour episode. Just saying that now. Um, but I will see you guys later for more Black and White Nuzlocke. Stay tuned, another hour-long episode, more good stuff's gonna happen. We'll be at the gym in the next episode, explore Castelia City. See you guys later.